Um, in terms of what we're seeing locally, gas prices have gone up. Absolutely. This is actually a story that we have covered on mornings several times now. So the real issue is that it's crude oil that's becoming more expensive. Mm -hmm. Russia is the second largest exporter of crude oil in the world, second only to America. And when those prices become more expensive, what we see at the gas pump just skyrockets. So I know that myself, I've kind of been yeah. pick, picky and choosy oh depending which gas station I want to go to. Every once in a while I get lucky, but I mean, sometimes you're paying 340 or almost three. 50 for just a gallon of regular gas right now it's crazy it absolutely makes all the difference yeah the gas station that i typically go to is just a block away but that map you're talking about if you go to our wbtv app and you click on the traffic tab we have that interactive map for people where they can find gas stations near them and figure out what the prices are that is such a helpful tool because if you have kids and you're carpooling a lot going to sporting games maybe you're commuting into the city yeah gas can get really expensive um we reported earlier this week that if you are commuting into Charlotte, you could be spending 25 or $50 more a week oh my on gas, which yeah. that's a lot of your paycheck and, and weekly know. budget. Yeah, and I've talked to local AAA representatives in the last couple of weeks. And of course, that big question that they're getting, is it going to get to $4 a gallon? And they're really keeping their fingers crossed. Yeah. It's not going to get there. But uh, last time I talked to them, gas was about in the same range. And they were saying that they were expecting it to go up, you know, maybe close to 10 cents more before we start to see it come down. Obviously, with the invasion happening in the overnight hours, now is really going to be that game changer in seeing what happens. Um, President Biden has talked a lot about imposing sanctions on Russia. That's one of yep. the things that that local family I talked to spoke mm -hmm. of. They're really hoping that those U.S. imposed sanctions on Russia is going to really encourage uh, President Vladimir Putin to hold off on an all out invasion. And it's not only going to protect family members, but hopefully we could see some uh, impact on inflation here as well. We've seen